Does my toddler have a speech delay? Every child reaches their milestones at their own pace, including the age at which they speak. What is considered appropriate communication regarding a typical developing toddler? Are you wondering, does my toddler have a speech delay? Throughout the first year of life, your baby will be developing their nonverbal communication skills. They will engage in crying for attention, when they are hungry, when they are tired, and they will also cry to let you know when it's time for a diaper change. As you learn your baby's cry, you are able to predict and respond to them according to their needs and desires. You will also become aware of their happiness and preferences by a smile displayed on their face. As they develop into a toddler at about 12 to 18 months, they will incorporate gestures to communicate. Gestures will often be paired with a sound. This sound or word approximation is your toddler's way of learning how to produce meaningful sounds, grasping the concept that words can replace crying. Encouraging your toddler to make a sound or word approximation for every request will increase your toddler's motivation for speaking. How do you know if your toddler has a speech delay? Most toddlers can say about 20 words by 18 months of age. By the time they turn two, they should be engaging in 50 or more words. At two years old, toddlers are also starting to combine two words to make simple sentences such as big dog or help me. Are you concerned that your toddler may have a speech delay? If you are curious about possible delays in your child's verbal skills or understanding of language, consider these factors all of which can play a role in speech and language delays. If your toddler suffers from physical impairments, they may prevent your toddler from correctly articulating words or process the words. In some cases, the toddler's internal communication system is not able to effectively carry a message between the brain and oral muscles to speak. It is important to note that if you are asking yourself, does my toddler have a speech delay, that you consider taking your toddler to see if they may have a hearing problem. If a toddler is suffering from hearing loss, they may be experiencing difficulty with understanding the speech around them as well as their own speech. If they suffer from chronic ear infections, their speech could also be affected. These type of infections are characterized by inflammation and infection in your toddler's middle ear that may not clear up with typical treatments and keep returning within short periods of time. If your toddler falls into that category, your pediatrician may want you to see an ear, nose, and throat or ENT specialist or may recommend that your toddler gets ear tubes. Hearing problems will make it a challenge for the toddler to master what specific words are, making it harder for them to imitate and use the word correctly. If you have had your toddler's hearing checked and it's fine, but you're still asking yourself, does my toddler have a speech delay? There are two other physical impairments that may cause a speech delay. These include a cleft palate and or an unusually short frenulum which is the fold that holds the underneath part of the tongue to the lower mouth. If your toddler has one or both of these physical impairments, they could have difficulty producing sounds, in turn causing a speech delay. If you are concerned that your toddler may have a speech delay, observe and see if they appear to have any oral motor problems. Oral motor problems include difficulty controlling the muscles and parts of the mouth that they use to speak. Are their lips, tongue, and jaw doing what they should do to produce certain words? How about when they chew? Do they have any problems with eating? There are oral stimulation tools that may be used to aid in developing and strengthening the oral motor muscles to improve speech. A speech delay may, however, be related to other developmental delays. You might want to speak with your pediatrician about having an assessment done for your toddler once you begin to notice that other skills and abilities are also developing at a slower rate. Specifically, take notice that motor, verbal, and cognitive skills are on target for your toddler's age level. 
If you are wondering if your toddler has a speech delay and that it is related to a developmental delay, it is important to observe if they are speaking very little or not at all. Acknowledge whether or not they understand what is being said by others, if they repeat what others say, or if they have no emotion or inflection when speaking. If you are asking yourself, does my toddler have a speech delay? There are some activities that you can do with them to enhance their growth and progress. First off, speak to your child often, narrating every move. Read them stories. The more words they hear, the more opportunities they have to learn words and imitate saying them. Also, purchase some occupational motor stimulating tools to encourage speech and sound production. As your toddler develops, make sure to have them use a whole word or word approximation for every request that they make. For more information about toddler development and speech delays, click the link below.